All right, vlog squad. We're gonna go on a trip to a camp. Oh. Yes. 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 I can't wait. So for this trip, we had to wake up early since the bus was gonna leave at 7. I woke up at 6.30, I did all my morning needs, and left the apartment. Zippy! Room, room. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Hello class, I have arrived. No one cares. Okay. We all waited till it was time to go, and uh, nothing interesting happened on the bus, so I'ma just skip to once we arrived to the camp. Okay, class, we made it! Um, get your asses out of the bus. Hi there, everyone, and welcome to Camp... Camp... Uh... Camp Kauai. <coughs> My name's Ashley, and I promise, you're all going to have a fun time here. Oh, I sure hope so. I hope nothing bad happens, you know? That would totally suck and make this trip the worst trip of my life. So Ashley and her team showed us around the camp. When we made it to the lake, she said later in the day we can go in and canoe. So one of my friends were like, we should totally go canoeing. She's the girl in the Summer Water War video. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I can't swim. Who said we're gonna swim? It's not like we're gonna sink. Canoeing looks pretty easy. Oh, I mean, all right. And blah, 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 it was finally time that we can go in the lake. There was no lifeguards on duty yet, but they said we could still go in, but not too far, since it's dangerous without surveillance. Yeah, um, me and Isiani didn't listen. <coughs> Isiani was the one that didn't listen, but uh, we're gonna find out why. We picked out a canoe and life jacket. So right then and there, there was already a third flag not to do this. One, I can't swim. Two, there was no lifeguards. And three, there was no more life jackets my size. I had to get a really small one that only covered my neck. I was practically choking too. It was so small that I couldn't move my neck. It was so stiff. So if I were to do something and it requires turning, I would turn my whole body. Hey, Perla. <clears throat> yes? Oh, oh God, what the, what the heck? I, I don't, I don't think that fits you. Um, yeah, I know, I know. But hey, I can't swim, and this, this could save my life. No, I can't. It's too small for you. Everything was ready, and me and Isiani sat on the canoe and paddled to a great adventure. <laughs> See? This isn't that bad. Yeah, I guess. Let's try not to die, huh? That was supposed to be a joke. Isiani had the greatest idea. The most brilliant idea I've, I've ever heard. Ever. Hey, I think we should go to the other side of the camp. Maybe there's some mysterious camp stuff there. It would be fun! Uh, that's, that's pretty far, and there's no life- Come on, we've got this. Nothing's going to happen. But I feel like we shouldn't do this, and if you don't remember, I can't swim! And like I said, who mentioned about swimming? Trust me, we got this. <sighs> Fine. We both paddled to see if we can manage to go to the other side, and we did it. Why? It was too far. Now, this is the part where me and Isiani paddle back and go back to the camp safely without sinking. But it didn't end up like that. If it did, I wouldn't have made this video. And... There's two sides of the story, my side and Isiani's side, about what actually happened and made the boat tip. Whose fault was it? Who's to blame? Me or Isiani? Who's the one lying? Who's the one telling the truth? Ugh. No one knows. That's why I'm telling both sides of the story. <coughs> Starting with mine. So, once she realized that it was too far, I said, okay, Isiani, I'm going to paddle back. So, please, Paddle with me! I started paddling and expected that she'd do the same. Two people in a canoe. Teamwork. Teamwork is the key. We can't just have one person do the work or else... Disaster. She was either spaced out or she wasn't paying attention or she was ignoring me. Who knows? And then I was like, hey, the boat is kind of heavy. What's going on? I looked down. And I see that there's water inside the canoe. I'm gonna drown. Now, before I show what happened after, 
I'm gonna tell Isiani's side of the story. According to Isiani, I turned the boat the opposite direction that she was turning, causing the canoe to tip over. <sighs> See how our stories point the finger to the other person? We don't know who it was. We can't agree to who it was. The story will remain unsolved. All right, now to the part where the canoe started sinking. Oh no, we're gonna die! Shit, 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 shit! Ah! And right there, I thought it was over. I was gone. Hey squad, I just came back from school because I forgot I didn't record anything for the end guard. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I've been gone for, uh, two months. I'm sorry about that, but, you know, things happen. Yeah, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Part two coming soon. Though, I think I'm gonna upload a Halloween video before part two. If I even manage to upload the Halloween video on Halloween. But yeah, part two after that fucking- Oops, I've cursed. Part two after that video. I need to keep recording. It's it's only 30 seconds. Um, I'll tell you about my day in school. It was bad. No, I lied. It was good. School's okay. Um, yeah. School. 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 Escuela! Okay, that's enough. Thanks. Uh, okay. Uh, bye. <laughs> I love you.